How to get started. Before getting started, first insert the mini SD memory card into the card slot on the side of the camera. Gently lift the rubber lid and insert the card. Now you can push the on-off button to start the camera. The LCD screen will light up and you're almost ready to go. Don't forget to open the lens cap. Set the camera to auto mode using the right selection button. You are in auto mode if there are no locks on the temperature scale. This mode allows you to capture images in the easiest way possible. Now aim the camera towards the target. Please keep in mind that the close focus limit is 0.6 meters. Any object located further away will be automatically in focus. For spotting hot spots, first point the camera to the selected target and point the crosshairs to the hottest point in the field of view. This appears bright white. Now you may press the right selection button to lock the temperature scale. In this way, you lock the temperature scale to the really interesting temperatures of your target, which allows easy inspection of your object. Repeat this procedure every time you select a new target. If you want to detect cold spots, air leakages and so on, point the crosshair at the coldest spot. This appears dark blue when using the iron and rainbow palette and dark grey when using the grey palette. Before capturing the image, make sure that the target covers the spot meter area as shown in the demonstration. Once you're satisfied with your findings, press the save trigger on the front of the camera to save the image. Next, switch off the camera. You can upload the images you've just grabbed to any computer using either the mini SD card or the included USB mini cable. If you use the mini SD card, insert it first into a card reader and connect it to your computer. Next, drag and drop the images from your SD card onto your desktop or any designated file.